All right, this is what's in your car again. Um, now we're at the Mustang. This is the second video. I don't care. Basically, it's if y'all watch the first one, you know what this is. But again, I nominate Zero Kzar, aka David, to review or do this with his uh, Subaru, and then. Uh, Mr. Peace Love Drums, I think that's what it is. Uh, his real name's Andrew, and he needs to do his Audi TTRS and his Volkswagen Jetta. I want to see the Volkswagen Jetta, but I really want to see the Audi. I, I, I have no idea. All right, this car is dirty. It's a little bit dirty, but it's not as dirty as the Cavalier because this thing sits, no joke, 90% of the time. There's gonna be absolutely nothing in here to show you. Nothing in the door maps. There's nothing in there. There's absolutely nothing in the cup holders. There is one receipt. And this is for Sonic. This is when I had a very bad milkshake when it had, it was sour milk. I'm gonna throw that away. Um. Sonic straws, gonna throw that away. Um, alright. I'm just gonna grab the camera. I don't know why I brought the tripod, even though really I'm not mainly using it. Yeah, get off. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Say nothing in the cup holders. There's one more straw piece down there. Center console, I got my tuner from Bama Performance when I tuned the car. Have that. This is for the tuner too. This is to go on the computer, change the tunes around, um, and then um, download updates. Flashlight. Yeah. Oh, got my charger. I don't have one in the Cavalier, surprisingly, but I do in the Mustang. Don't know why. And then stuff to clean glasses with, because I don't have a place it for this in the Cavalier. I, all this stuff in here, except the tuner, was all stuff from the red Mustang. But that's when I actually had room, and I actually daily drove the thing. So, yeah. This car just normally sits now. But I still drive it. Uh, again... This is the warranty for my tires. I have like a 90 something thousand mile warranty. This is title, registration, proof of insurance, back seat. I have a Android charger. Hmm, I don't know why that's back there. I don't even have one. This is for um, multiple charger things because it only has two. One in there and then one down there. It glows blue, cut it out of auto zone because I'm a ricer. Um, again, something to check the oil with if I ever had to. Uh, this is uh, something that my dad bought when we go to Cars and Coffee. It's just the auction thing with a whole bunch of that. All that stuff is probably outdated. All of it's probably sold. And then under the seat, if I can never get it, is something to clean yeah it, it's my big red dildo but um a thing to clean the car with that was in the red mustang and then i took it out because we got to sell it of course and well i didn't have to i just wanted to but I had to take it out because i wasn't going to give him a free thing of dildo -iness. This is going to sound so weird. I feel so sad for myself. Because race car. How about that? We'll just do what Evan Shakes did. Because race car. This actually needs to go in the trunk, but it stays in the back seat. I'm going to throw everything up in the back seat real quick. Because, let's be honest, guys. Everyone in the Mustangs, they know the back seats are practically non-functional for this car. I mean, on a scale to 1 to 10 of functionality, it's a negative 100. Like, that's how bad it is. Uh, the trunk. 
This is where I put my dead hookers. I wrap them up in that, and um, I, I put them back here. But no, um, this is a car um, cover for when the car is actually clean, which if you look here, it's actually not. And that's actually it. That's actually really surprising. That's all that's in the trunk here is just that. Got my light to work. Um, yeah, the Mustang's actually cleaner than what I actually thought it was. All right, um, to the race car.